good morning all today we are going to see something about preoperative oral carbohydrate loading which is a component of eras protocol that is enhanced recovery after surgery protocol optimal nutritional state is important consideration in successful operative outcome unfortunately many aspects of surgery are not constructive to producing this one of such aspect is overnight fasting why there is a tradition of preoperative overnight fasting it is thought to decrease the gastric volume and gastric acidity which in turn decreases the vomiting and risk of pulmonary aspiration but there is no evidence that a short and fast of 2 to 3 hours for clear liquids increases the risk of aspiration or regurgitation compared to fasting overnight what is the existing lacune and why we need a paradigm shift patients with overnight fasting experiences thirst hunger and they will be anxious and they experience some sort of malaise overnight fasting increases the risk of post operative nausea vomiting electrolyte imbalance which in turn leads to hypovolemia hemodynamic instability and decrease in the oxygen delivery to tissues and leads to poor wound healing and fasting is also a stress response which leads to increase in metabolic increase in the metabolic and immune response to stress which in turn increases the insulin resistance and a catabolic state what are the benefits of carbohydrate loading from the fasting it leads to a metabolically fit state without the risk of aspiration it decreases the insulin resistance helps to control blood glucose level post operatively there is faster return of bowel function and it preserves lean body mass as well as muscle strength at in turn it decreases the length of hospital stay overall decrease in the morbidity and mortality what is the quantity of carbohydrate which we have to load 100 grams of carbohydrate the night before surgery and 50 grams 2 hours prior to surgery there are commercial preparations available which contains 12.5% complex carbohydrate that is maltodextrin what are the concerns in surgical patients with type 2 diabetes mellitus does preoperative carbohydrate loading delay gastric emptying gastric emptying of carbohydrate containing beverages is similar between healthy controls and those with well controlled type 2 diabetes mellitus or insulin resistance does the preoperative carbohydrate loading increases the risk of hyperglycemia preoperative glucose may be 12.5 to 52.4 mg per deciliter increase in patients with type 2 diabetes mellitus who consume a carbohydrate load blood glucose returns to baseline 3 hours post conception in t2dm patients intraoperative and postoperative blood glucose were not consistently different between groups the last concern is does carbohydrate loading increases the risk of perioperative complications there is no difference in aspiration pneumonia 30 day wound occurrence or wound infections was reported two studies report no difference in length of hospital stay and one reported a decrease in the length of hospital stay with carbohydrate loading to conclude poor nutritional status in surgical patients leads to suboptimal outcomes and well nourished patient experience a better outcome carbohydrate loading definitely attenuate the insulin resistance and decreases the protein breakdown and loss of lean body mass thank you